guys welcome back to my channel um i don't know if you guys are gonna be able to hear me i have my cooler on and my husband's vacuuming but i haven't been vlogging lately just because like i've been saying everything's so hectic and busy i'm trying to reorganize my closet right now i'm in my hallway and let me just show y'all all right y'all see this closet so down here i have all this crap that i just pulled out right and it is chaotic. It's a mess. Um, there's just trash in here. Like, it just kind of became our little... I don't know if you guys ever seen Friends. Um, that episode where uh, Chandler's trying to get into Monica's closet. <laughs> That's kind of what this closet looked like before. So, um, we are cleaning. My husband's vacuuming. We're going to try to go to the movies. Hi, baby. Why are you staring at me like that? I'm coming. We're gonna try to go to the movies later, but I just have a lot to do here, so I'm probably not gonna go today. And then earlier, our whole electricity went out, so it's now five o'clock, and our electricity just came on probably like 20 minutes ago. So we're trying to finish up what we're doing, and it's like 108 degrees today. It is crazy hot, but um, yeah, and I look all grainy. I'm sorry, like I said, it's a dark hall. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and say hi. I'll talk to you guys a little bit later and I have so many new videos that I will probably start posting after the 4th of July after this weekend I'm gonna knock out these videos for you because I have so many new things I have to share with you guys and there's heavy <laughs> yeah yeah he's it, it's hot y'all it's hot but anyway I'm about to finish doing what I gotta do and then I'll talk to you guys a little bit later guys good morning today is Thursday I think Hold on, check. yep Thursday I'm in the car heating it up my husband's trying to get the dog inside um we're about to go to my mom's I have to do laundry and then my brother and my husband have to go get um take my my husband's taking my brother to city college to take his assessment test um uh, so I can go ahead and finish enrolling and yeah, get his classes for next semester. And then my husband has to go check on his financial aid. So I get to stay home and do laundry while he's off doing the stuff he needs to do. We just ordered um, my computer. I've been trying to get my computer fixed. And remember I told you guys the motherboard was not working. I kind of mentioned that in my gear procrastination video. Um, but we ordered a part for it and it turns out the part that we ordered was not even like it doesn't even work so it's stupid so I guess the part was just like sold as parts I don't know I have no idea so now we have to order another separate part so now that's going to be an additional like $80 that we spent so I'm just like I feel like just freaking throwing the computer away and just grabbing a new one, like buying a new one. Like, what's the point of continuing to try to fix this one? It just bums me out because all my information is on there <clears throat> and my editing programs are on there, which I'm pretty sure they already got deleted. But I don't know. It's annoying. Anywho, we're about to go to my mom's, pick up my brother. And I get dropped off there. Maybe I'll vlog a little bit later. I kind of want tacos today. So maybe I can convince my mama to make tacos. I don't know. We'll see. And what else is going on? I don't know if I told you guys. But I am having my mom move in with me. Um, she will be moving into my spare bedroom. And my little brother's going to be moving in. Which I'm kind of like excited and anxious at the same time about it. Because my mom is exactly like me. Um we can be very stubborn and the relationship between me and my siblings is okay but the relationship between my husband and my sibling one of my siblings is not the best so I don't know how that's really gonna work out um, I'm just hoping everything stays cool calm and collected <laughs> uh, but yeah so that's pretty much all I'm doing today just laundry day and it's hot you guys yesterday it's like cloudy I don't know if you can see that but yesterday it like thunderstormed, the light kept going in and out, and the electricity kept going off. Um, 
the same thing. I said it twice. Yes, I know. <laughs> but it's just been like raining. And then this morning it was raining again. It's just like humid though. It's not even hot. It's not hot, but then it's not cold. It's just humid. It's, that's disgusting. So, today I'm going to be filming a Throwback Thursday video, which I'm kind of excited about. Oops, don't unlock this door. I'm going to be filming a Throwback Thursday video for you guys, and I should be getting that up like in the next hour or two. But, yeah. There's my husband. In La La Land, not paying attention to me. Anyhow, I will talk to you guys a little bit later once I get to my mom's house or something. Okay, bye. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Dallas. What are you doing, babe? What? Look, do you see him? What do you want? Are you hungry? You want to go outside? Oh, hold on one second. Okay, so it is Friday, I believe. My mom has been, I don't know if I mentioned it to you guys, but my mom will be moving into my house. Um, she, it, it's just, to me, it's just kind of like the best option. We're always at her house anyways. And I just feel like um, with her moving in, she's going to be able to help me a little bit with uh, bills and stuff. And not only that, but um, we want to eventually get our own house. So that's going to help us save. Um, but um, I feel like it's just the whole moving process can be so stressful. And I'm just like, I don't know. I feel like. Like, okay, when I say I'm going to vlog for you guys and I told you guys I'm going to start making videos for you guys, I want to be completely honest and, you know, share my true experiences with you guys. But um, I feel like right now, me and my husband are just kind of going through the stage where it's, I don't know if it's the heat or it's the fact that he's working so much and he's going to get ready to start school. It's just stressing him out. Um... I don't know what it is, but it just seems like we're always bickering about the smallest things. And I swear we fight or we argue about things and maybe like two hours later we're fine. But it's just annoying to be in that mid stage where we are actually arguing and fighting and, you know, having disagreements about whatever the case might be. Um, it's just, it's just hard. Being married is hard. Uh, I actually wanted to record a video for you guys um, talk about marriage because I think there's this misconception, uh, misconception, conception. Am I saying this right? Probably not. <laughs> but there's this misunderstanding when it comes to marriage, and I think a lot of people think and believe that it's really easy, and you know, once you get married, um, you're gonna be able to live with the person you love, and you're gonna be able to just be happy and alone, and just everything's gonna be all strawberries and ice creams, and you know everything's gonna be all great great <laughs> and that's really not the truth being married is hard being married um, you know there's a lot of things you have to sacrifice there's a lot of things that you have to go through that you go through with your spouse um, you know especially for us I think our first year of marriage was the hardest year um, we were being married now going on three years um, but the first year was just craziness like it was hard so I'm, I'm probably I'm gonna be recording that video uh, shortly. Um, today I am recording a fearless fat girl video, and it's gonna be um, regarding sex. So I f I'll probably link that in the description bar of this video, so you guys can check that out if you guys missed it. Um, but yeah, it's just it's life, right? Um, shit happens, and you know you get in and misunderstandings and disagreements and it's natural I'm just you know dealing with it going with the flow and trying to like make the best of it and I'm watching my dog that's why I'm not looking at you guys but I'm trying to just make the best of it and you know grow from these experiences and you know keep moving forward which is all you can really do What's up, baby? Um, but yeah it's just it's just been a little stressful I hope you guys are having a much better week but that's what my life is like right now. Um, 
I am, I'm gonna show you guys my room. My room is pretty like dirty and stuff. I have so much to do. My bedroom pillows are out here. Um, I'm gonna show you guys, okay? I have this canvas here that I'm selling. I wanted this for over my bed, but it, um, I think it's too big, I don't know. I think it's too big. Then I have a laundry basket full of laundry that's clean, I have to put it away. Um, next I have these, my bed is full of shoes, let me turn this light on. My bed is full of shoes, um, I'm gonna be selling some either, and these are like brand new shoes too, you guys. Like, okay, these are like the cutest things ever. They're red, they're from Torrid's. They're a size nine, I believe. Yep, and I've never worn them. Look at them, they're super cute. Look at they're brand new. They even still have that little plastic on the bottom. So I'm gonna be selling those. Then I also bought these from Torrid's. They're still brand new. Um, I've never used them. Still have the plastic on the bottom. I'm gonna be selling those as well. And then I have these that I was given to. Uh, my best friend gave these to me and I wasn't going to sell them because she gave them to me, but I can't wear them and I'm thinking of maybe using them as decoration in my room, but I don't know because they're pretty big so I might just keep them and do a DIY with them, but they're new. They're like really, really new shoes. Let me see if I have any other ones that I'm selling. I did have a lot of shoes. Um, these used to be my go-to like heels back in the day like these I could go to the club in some jeans or capris and I'd be like set I'd be good to go all night I can't do that no more oh I'm probably gonna be selling these as well and these are really cute they're from um, just fab and they're brand new too as you guys can see brand new and I just never wore them um, yeah, so I have some, so I have to go through these shoes and I have to sell stuff. Um, and then these boxes already got sold, so um, I just prepared them so that they can take them. And then this area right here, I'm gonna flip the screen for you guys. Are you guys ready? Because this is a disaster. <laughs> okay, so the mirror, I'm probably gonna end up returning it just because I never found another one and it's still broken. Um, and the chaos starts here. Um, ooh, let me remove that. Um, I have bills and stuff that I was going through, all kinds of paperwork. I wanted to do a review on these products, but I never got a chance to. Then I bought this at the Dollar Tree, and I wanted to dye my extensions, so they're right there. And then I needed a makeup bag for inside my um, purse. Because I don't want anything to spill in there. And then I'm starting to get things ready. I want to do a giveaway. So I've been like purchasing things here and there. It's not going to be a huge giveaway. Just, uh, you know, just some things that I really enjoy and that I think you guys would enjoy. So, yeah, that's that. And then I have to go through these drawers because my makeup is crazy, like... I don't even want to show you guys. It's so embarrassing. Oh, and then I have a plate there because I was doing a DIY with painting and I was using those to put the that acrylic paint in. Um, I'm scared to show you guys this drawer. There's no point in me trying to fix it because it looks a hot mess either way. Okay, so this is a drawer <laughs> that I have to clean out. Um, when I moved the, my vanity from over there, I just pretty much took everything out of the drawers and threw it I mean, out of on top the way I had it organized because I had other little containers and just threw everything in the drawers. So it's a mess. I have to reorganize this drawer. Then the drawer that was right here is over there. Dallas, stop. That is over there because I had, I guess, a lotion in there or something and it exploded and it came out. So that's a mess. Let me move this back from the floor. Then I have to still go and pay rent. Then I have that box that's full of makeup and my vitamins. And then this is bag is full of makeup. And these things here, um, this one is a picture frame and I have to, um, it's a DIY project that I want to do with it. That's my new camera. 
in the bag that I'm going to definitely show you guys very, very soon. I'm super excited to do that video for you guys. And then I just have different crap on the bottom. So this section right here is like, whoa, like it needs a whole new makeover. Then I have my yoga mat and I have some workout stuff in there. It's just my room is a mess and it's like killing me slowly. Like I just need to reorganize, uh, redecorate. And yeah, I am thinking of just going to get another mirror for there and just wait till I find something I really, really love. I also need your guys' opinions and advice on what I should put over this section. That is where the canvas was supposed to go. Um, but I just think it's just square, square. I don't know if you guys get it, but I think it's like it's a square and then another square and another square. It's just going to be squares everywhere. So I really wasn't feeling that idea. So I was thinking of just using frames and doing maybe like a picture collage there. Um, I don't know. I'm just like, it's so much wall and I just don't know what to do with it. <laughs> but I really need to put something there just because it's super like plank, plank, that's not even a word, super blank and empty. Then I used to have my mirror and my vanity on this wall. You guys can still kind of see the outlines of the mirror and the vanity and then the lighting, I'm sorry. And I need to put something on that wall because it just feels super empty and I don't know. If you guys have any ideas, please let me know because I am desperate and I need I need help, okay? I need help. These walls are just too blank for my liking and I need something on them. Um, but yeah, let me flip this camera around. That's kind of what I've been dealing with. Um, it's not as hot as it has been. It's kind of cooled down. I mean, it's still like 99 degrees, but it beats being 108 degrees all day, every day. So I'm pretty happy about that. I do have to go through this, uh, drawer section. I've mentioned it before. My husband is a really, this is the type of person he likes to stash things, okay? And it's bad. Like, he'll just place things on top of things and just to put it, set it down. And, and I try, I'm trying to get him out of that habit, but it is what it is. Um, so this drawer, I've fixed it like a million times. And if you guys could see what's in here, you guys would be like, what the hell? Because it is so messy. I need to buy containers for it and organize things. Um, the very last drawer down there, I have all kinds of brand new, never used products. So I'm going to do a what's in my drawer, my brand new door, drawer, and then some of those items I will be doing a giveaway with. So yeah, I don't know. I got to figure it out. Maybe I'll do a giveaway with one of the shoes or something. I don't know. I don't know. Your, your girl needs to get her life together because this room is driving me bananas and I do not, I feel, I'm one of those people that if my room is a mess, I get like antsy and anxious and it's not fun. And then I get mad because it's dirty and I, I don't like it. I'm not, I'm not a fun person when my room is a mess. I don't like it. It gives me anxiety. <laughs> but that's pretty much what I'm doing. Um, and then in this room, I already took everything out that was mine. Um, my little brother is going to be staying in this bedroom now. So he has started to bring some of his stuff in here. So that's all his stuff that he needs to organize. Then I wanted to do, uh, I probably still will because I have the footage in my camera. But I wanted to do a room tour of my mom's room. And I'm just going to give you guys a little glimpse of what it looks like now. I do have clips of it the way it used to look beforehand, before she started, um, you know, putting her stuff in here and things. But I'm just gonna show you real quick what it looks like now. Um, the walls are pink and blue. That's just, that's just the color she liked. My mom has always been extra bold and bright and that's just what she likes and that's fine. That's my mama. Uh, but she redid this closet which is pretty cool. I like the way it turned out. Um, I think it has a lot of storage place and places to hang stuff, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then this is the stuff that she's brought in so far. And of, if you can get kind of like the the scheme of what her bedroom's gonna be, it's gonna be pink and zebra. So yeah, it's it's coming along. She even has a little chair. My mom, my mom's a diva, y'all. She likes that type of stuff <laughs> so that's what this room looks like Dallas out but yeah I'm, I'm like trying to get my stuff together you guys 
Then, I don't know if you guys can hear me. Hopefully you guys can. But I want to redo this. I'm thinking of placing this. I was going to sell it as well. Ow. Just got myself. Um, I wanted to sell it. Hold on. Give me. Okay. So I was going to sell this this frame right here. Let me see if you guys can see that. See her? I love her. It's super huge. I was selling her. But I think what I'm going to do is just hold on to her and she's probably going to go in my bedroom so she looks like that I, I don't know I'm just in love with her and I've had her since um oh man she cost me a pretty book I've had her since like I don't know Texas I think yeah since like 2010 so I've had her for a while and I really love her, so I'm thinking I'm just gonna keep her and put her in my room somewhere. I just don't know where. Oh, and also in here, this TV, okay, you guys see all this mess right here? It irks me and drives me banana. I need to find a way to store my husband's things that makes it easy for him to. So uh, if you guys have any ideas or any advice on how to store um, his items so that it's easy for him to just continuously um, put the stuff back where it goes please let me know because I need to figure out a way as you guys can see look at that's my shoe rack and those are his shirts yeah but I love that man but anyways like I was saying this TV what's wrong with you what you eating scares me um, this TV is gonna be actually going into my mom's bedroom and my living room TV is gonna be going in here and I want it to mount it on the wall um, but I don't know how sturdy these walls are, so I don't know. I, I really wanted it mounted on, oh, sorry, babe. I really wanted it mounted on the wall, but I gotta figure things out. I'm telling you guys, my life right now is a mess, and I'm trying to, like, recuperate from last, um, month, and yeah. So, um, I will probably, this will probably be the end of this vlog, and I will most likely be posting this maybe tonight, because I know tomorrow it's going to be a long day and I'm probably going to vlog all day tomorrow because um, tomorrow is 4th of July so if I I am going to just post this today um, I am going to get hopefully next once I you know clear out my bed I'm going to start recording my fearless fat girl video for you guys and um, have that up as soon as possible but um, yeah I guess I was do any of you guys' dog do this? I know I said bye, but I wanted to show you guys real quick. Look, he wants to play with it. He wants to, like, he wants me to grab it and throw it so he could go get it. But he won't let it go. And if I start playing with it, he'll, like, drop it. Watch. I told you, he drops it. Let's see. Ouch. Look at he brings it to me and then he'll let it go. Watch, hold on. You see? You see? He drops it because he wants you to grab it and throw it. Look here. Get down. Ow, you jerk. You bit me. <laughs> but yeah. And he does that all the time. But yeah, he won't let it go. Like, he just doesn't get the concept of catch and, you know, like, fetch. <laughs> a fetch and throw or whatever catch and throw or yeah he 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 doesn't know but anyways um i guess we will talk to you guys later say bye dallas says bye with his towel <laughs> bye